While the gateway arch towers like a giant against the beaming sun, 630 feet in the sky, inside the mammoth structure, the North Tram loading area is being transformed into a history museum. With our new exhibit, we're trying to tell the story of how the arch was built, uh, starting with the original concept and finishing on that last day when they put the final piece in place, uh, October 28, 1965. TV monitors are in place to show videos of the historic construction project. Snapshots cover the North Tram's once barren walls to show more of the same. We think the completion of our new exhibits is going to add a, a new dimension to what people get to see and experience when they come to the arch. The South exhibit, a recreation of the St. Louis Riverfront in the 1800s, was completed a few months ago. Workers have spent nearly a year on both exhibits. A lot of work, a lot of time. It's a lot of fun. Construction crews spent two and a half years building the arch, and now, after more than 30 years, their story will be told to almost a million arch visitors every year. So as they ride to the top of the arch and they actually get to look in the interior, the legs of the arch, they can be thinking back about those workers that risked their lives to actually build this huge architectural and engineering marvel that we have here in St. Louis. All involved with this project say when the North exhibit opens to the public this weekend, it will be a dream come true. On the Arch Grounds, Leo Starworth, ABC 30 News.